All praise to Almighty Allah, we seek His peace and blessing upon the noble soul among mankind. This video holds the following topics about the month of Safar. Introduction Facts about the month of Safar Misconceptions about the month of Safar Historical events which took place in this month What are the Muslim beliefs about the month of Safar? Introduction This month is also known as, Safarul Muzaffar or Safarul Khair, which means, prosperous, successful, good fortunate and so on is to eradicate the corrupt beliefs of some people who say, the month of Safar is bad luck, evil, ill omened, unfortunate and so on, so marriages and major transactions must not be conducted in the month of Safar. Facts about the month of Safar Safar is the second of the twelve Islamic months. It comes after Muharram. It is one of the four months that Allah has declared as sacred. As Allah says, verily, the number of months with Allah is twelve months, in a year, so was it ordained by Allah on the day when he created the heavens and the earth, of them four are sacred, that is the first, the seventh, the eleventh and the twelfth months of the Islamic calendar. That is the right religion, so wrong not yourselves therein, Quran, 936. Misconceptions about the month of Safar there are many misconceptions about the month of Safar that have been carried through generations among them are. 1. Nikah performed in the month of Safar would not be successful. 2. The month is full of misfortune and calamities. 3. To commence any business in this month will lead to a loss. 4. The first to the thirteenth of Safar is ill fortune and evil. 5. The person who distributes food or money on the 13th of Safar will be saved from its ill fortune. 6. To celebrate the last Wednesday of Safar and regard it as a holiday. 7. Some engages in activities which they believe would do away with bad luck, such as boiling chickpeas, making flower balls, and throwing them in water and reciting Zura Mazamal 313 times. Note. Such beliefs and superstitions are haram, however, are self-created, bidder, and cannot be verified from Quran and Sunnah, for Allah has not made any of the twelve months as inauspicious. Holding such beliefs is an act of innovation and is not permissible in Islam. Historical events which took place in this month Some very important events took place in the month of Safar among the Ma. 1. The Battle of Abwa and the Battle of Kaba both took place in Safar. 2. Martyrdom of Kubay ibn Adi, Radiyallahu and Zayd ibn Dardina, Radiyallahu Anu, took place in Safar. 3. It also marks the acceptance of Islam by Khalid and bin Alwaz. 4. Prophet Muhammad's, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, beloved daughter Fatima, Radiyallahu Anna, married with Ali in this month. These events indicate the auspiciousness of this month and truly condemn any misconception associated with the month of Safar. What will be your belief as a Muslim? 1. To shun all types of erroneous beliefs regarding the blessed month of Safar. 2. To understand that the most unfortunate person is he who disobeys Allah to Allah's commandments for example does not perform the five daily salah and so on. It is narrated in a hadith that Rasulullah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, said, Pray, O Allah, cause not any one of us to be a wretched destitute. He then asked, Do you know who is a wretched destitute? Upon the request of the Sayaba, radiallahu to Allah anam, he replied, a wretched destitute is he who neglects his salat. 3. We should understand that all conditions which befalls us, good or bad, favorable, or unfavorable are from Allah to Allah, as a result of our actions. Allah to Allah says, whatever misfortune befalls you, it is due to the things your hands have wrought, and he forgives many a sin. Zura 42, verse 30. 4 have full belief in the hadith of prophet where he said there is no superstitious owl bird no star promising rain no bad omen in the month of safar 
Sahih Bukhari, Hadith 5707. There is no bad omen in the month of Safar and no ghouls, evil spirits. Sahih Muslim, Hadith 2222. Abu Huraira said, The Messenger of Allah, blessings and peace of Allah be upon him, said, no adwa, transmission of infectious disease without the permission of Allah, no terror, superstitious belief in bird omens, no hammer, refers to a Jewahili Arab tradition described variously as, a worm that infests the grave of a murder victim until he is avenged, an owl, or the bones of a dead person turned into a bird that could fly, and no safar, the month of safar was regarded as unlucky in the Jahili ear but flee from the leper as you would flee from a lion. Narrated by Al-Bukhari, 5387, and Muslim, 2220. Follow us on Twitter.com slash Dawa Nigeria, and on Facebook, Facebook.com slash Dawa Nigeria. To support this and lots of other good work, please visit DawaNigeria.com slash support. For our online and offline donation channels, Java Ninja, reviving the Kuma. Bye, bye, bye.